We will make sure that when a kid is in the womb, they're as safe as they are in a classroom. Hello, it's Alonzo Bowden back again with Rebel HQ and TYT. And guess what? Sarah's back. And I want to thank you, Sarah, for proving my saying to be true. Stupid, don't get tired. That's right. Sarah says we want to make sure that the baby is as safe in the womb as it is in the classroom. Yeah, let's say that again. The baby is as safe in the womb as it is in the classroom. This is almost in a backward way a pro-choice statement because sadly kids aren't safe in the classroom. I don't know if you've heard Sarah, things are getting kind of rough. I wonder is she just this used to lying or has she trained herself over the years to not listen to anything she actually says so she can make statements like this and they don't affect her at all? Wow, Sarah, nice move. You know what the really sad thing is? She's not even the worst Huckabee. She was spawned by a far more terrible Huckabee than that Huckabee. I feel like Huckabee is turning into a swear word, or at very least it should. Listen, Sarah, I know that you burst onto the scene as the mouthpiece of a malignant sunburned tumor brought to life by a witch's curse, but did that experience not teach you how to not look like a complete and utter moron when you open your mouth? No, wait, you were paid to look like a complete and utter moron when you opened your mouth because that's what your base likes. I don't know. Maybe the Republican plan is to arm the fetus. I mean, they want to arm the teachers, right? They want to arm everybody, everybody. You get a gun, you get a gun. Everybody going to carry a gun. They want to arm the teachers. There are commercials showing kids with guns learning to shoot. So why not the fetus? Maybe that's what the founding fathers meant somewhere in the Second Amendment, that every fetus has the right to carry a gun and protect it. So I'm really not sure. <laughs> I hate to laugh, but this is... is staggering. Do you know why this is so funny? Because Sarah Huckabee Sanders is likely the next governor of Arkansas. I mean, she's got, she won the party nomination. They, they love her dad. She's got huge name recognition. She's a Trumper. She's got everything required to win a Republican election. So the next governor of Arkansas saying your baby will be as safe in the womb as it is in a classroom, meaning not safe at all. And you know what the really sad part is? She won. That was an acceptance speech for the Republican Party gubernatorial primary in a state where she's, you know, a fair chance to win the election simply because daddy was governor. Maybe we should get her and Tim Smith together, just the intellectual titans of conservatism. So this is fascinating. The Republicans think a woman, they are progressive enough to think a woman can be the governor of the entire state, yet at the same time, they don't think a woman can govern her entire body. Isn't that amazing? So you can make decisions about the state's budget or, or I don't know, the state's health care plan or whatever other things come up in governing Arkansas, and yet you can't decide that maybe you don't want to have this baby because you were raped or because there's some health concern or it's a risk to your life or the baby's going to be born, unfortunately, stillborn or whatever your reason for having an abortion, it doesn't matter. You're not allowed to make that decision, but you can make decisions for the entire state. That is, I, I don't even know, this is one more time where I cannot get my head around the Republican logic. All right, lady, you can govern a state. You can't govern your body. Yeah, that somehow makes sense. I got to read the Bible more because I missed this part. So I just Googled who's going to be running against Sarah Huckabee Sanders as, for governor of Arkansas, and it is a man named Chris Jones. And Chris Jones is a black man. Now, I'm not psychic, and I know nothing about Arkansas politics, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be an uphill battle for a black candidate to be beat Sarah Huckabee Sanders in Arkansas. I'm just saying. Now, normally it would be an amazing, an amazing election and so progressive to see a woman running against a black man to be governor of Arkansas. But in this case, the woman is Sarah Huckabee Sanders. So I say, uh, good luck, Arkansas. And, and this whole thing, the baby is as safe in the womb as it is in a classroom. All I can think is if your baby is born healthy, you might want to keep the poor child out of school. 
I don't know. I don't know how this is going to play out, but man, what a mess. Just remember, this is a statement that will not be used against her because if Chris Jones tries to use this in a campaign ad, they'll somehow come out with him being anti-baby intelligence. I don't know. I really, I don't know.